world is facing a crisis. It's a crisis that is hampering global efforts to solve the world's most pressing development challenges. It is a crisis of poor data. Limitations in data production, quality, access and use are preventing progress in every area from health to gender equality, human rights to poverty, education to energy. But change is on the way. New, robust and powerful data ecosystems are emerging and a data revolution is underway. The Global Partnership for Sustainable Development Data is an unprecedented, independent, multi-stakeholder initiative working to harness the data revolution for sustainable development. The Global Partnership on Sustainable Development Data is focused on making sure that the global goals, the global sustainable development goals, are realized. One of the major ways that those goals will actually have impact and change the lives of all the people of the world, and particularly the most poor and vulnerable, is by ensuring that the best and most effective use of data happens. The more than 100 partners of the Global Partnership for Sustainable Development Data are joining forces to strengthen political commitment, align action, foster collaboration, spur innovation, and build trust in the booming data ecosystems of the 21st century. We're covering the surface of this planet with sensor systems uh, in our pockets, in the oceans, in the sky, and in space. And these can help us to provide the data that we need in order to help the monitoring and verification of the sustainable development goals. If we can't measure the, the choices that individuals are making and their daily preferences, and if we can't see how our systems are performing, we can't make informed decisions about how to sort of improve practices. So data really is crucial to the whole, the whole agenda. Whatever we are doing is about people's lives, it's about our planet, it's about citizens, it's about hearts and minds, it's about knowledge, it's about enabling impact in people's lives. The Global Partnership is open to any organization dedicated to harnessing data to achieve sustainable development. Global Partnership champions come from governments, companies, civil society organizations, international organizations, academic institutions, charities, and official statistics and data communities. Through the Global Partnership, these champions are bridging data gaps and improving data quality, access, and use. The beauty of the data revolution uh, and, and, and the, the Global Partnership and what has really inspired um, our government is the potential to, you know, eradicate poverty you know, and hunger and ensure that every Kenyan has food on the table. Data is political. Data can be disruptive. And there's a lot of stakeholders that have interest in data. So the power of this uh, global partnership on sustainable development data is that we're bringing together government data with private sector data, community and citizen generated data, with earth observation data, and geospatial data. The work of the Global Partnership has already begun. The Global Partnership is supporting its champions to produce data roadmaps and tools that countries need to plot their own development paths. It is convening data forums to generate political commitment and spark innovation. It is working to improve coordination, catalyze new collaborations, and it's making sure that data systems are compatible and well-funded. In short, it is creating the enabling environment needed to make data work for people and the planet. For people working with data, you have never seen this much political attention and this much commitment from all kinds of partnerships to come together to do this. It's absolutely inspiring. You begin to see huge potentials as we go forward. So this is the time to be alive. This is the time to work for data. This is an exciting time to live in. It is due to the tireless work of hundreds and thousands of people that made this possible. And this partnership, this movement, will grow to 10,000s, 100,000s, millions, and billions over the next 15 years.